Have you been wanting to try on the latest runway trends but can't afford the hefty price tag that comes with being ahead of the fashion pack? Well, good news fashionistas! Razor TV shows you just how to get the hottest runway looks without breaking the bank. Hi, so today we are here at Boogie Street, which is the secret of many budget fashionistas. We're here with Randolph, who will be styling our catwalk looks for less for the day. And we have our model, Elaine, who will be modelling our looks for today. So let's check it out. Randolph Tan, who has two years of experience in the industry, has styled the likes of Art and Nadia Hutagalung, editorials for local publications as well as international publications from Japan all the way to New York. To start off, we asked Randolph about the noteworthy trends for the upcoming Fall Winter Designer Runway collection. Okay, there's a lot of movements going on, fluid kind of looks. Um, white, a lot of white, like um, Alexander McQueen has white in them, yeah. Chanel has white in them. Why not we try sleeveless, because there are quite a lot of sleeveless, even Givenchy has sleeveless also this season. And then we found it, a white sleeveless Nicole Miller Fall Winter inspired white fringe top, incorporating two fall winter trends in one. Mm, what about the metal tip collars? Because I see them everywhere on the street. I think it's a very Singapore trend though. It's a Singapore yeah, trend? Yeah, I think it's a very Singapore trend. A lot of <laughs> not girls, on the catwalk? Not on the catwalk. We don't really see metal tip. But it's really funny because like, if you talk about other shopping centres, also like Far East Plaza and all, yeah. a lot of them has a been lot, going on with yeah. metal tips. So let's get you a bottom. Yeah. I was thinking of getting something long for her. I think that's flowy and liquid prints so, so they are very in. What about this? Straight off the Fall Winter 2012 runway? Hmm, not quite yet. I don't like the lining where they put up. Yeah. They don't have belts here, so. Yeah. I mean, I, I strongly believe in style, there's nothing that's considered right or wrong as long as you put it the right way, it creates a look and style. Right. So for example, like for belts, you just don't, you don't have to just, you know, wear one belt. You can wear more than that just to create a more chunky effect or so. One, two and three belts later, and Elan looks bang on trend. White, check. Fringe, check. Bright floral prints, check. Flowy liquid texture, check. Right now for the fall winter, actually we featured like what we call cyber princess. Cyber princess. Yes, cyber princess. Uh, we think about Jeremy Scott, um, the bold and crazy colors. Um, Chanel came out with all the crystal-looking uh, patterns. The military look was another trend making its rounds on the runway, with Victoria Beckham and Jason Wu both incorporating the masculine look in their fall winter collection. Look at this shop. But I wasn't sure. Maybe? Sure, yeah, there's a few things that we can work with here. Galaxy. Look at this, it's so fun. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> we won't show that. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> so when I take this out, I have to like go like go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there's so many things from this shop. You can do like a cyber princess. Look at the yeah. prince. Oh gosh. Exactly. You can't get any more cyber princess than this. So many things to play with. What oh, is hipster beyond hipster? <laughs> Unicorn space, you got it all like right there. Amazing, look at the prices of all this. $29. Yeah, it's cool. Cyber and sheer. Sure. Sure. <laughs> I'm starting to become an expert on <laughs> ish. Do they actually talk the designers or they just somehow get inspired by the same things? Oh same no, time? because every time when they have to do like a new season itself, designers actually have to gather and they have to agree on what is going to be the trend. That's why you see the influence in so many. I didn't know they do that. They have like a council which actually discuss on what is what is the next fabric, what is oh. the next um, trend which is going to appear. So we need pants for this look. We All need right, we we'll look for some. Um, it is a pants. Pajamas. Pajamas, pants, masculine, androgyny. androgyny. For winter. Turn back. 
I just want to see. Oh, look at the details. Hey, cut out. Cut out details. Nice. Um, one thing also, we can cheat with clothes. Uh huh. Try to tuck this in and let's see how it looks like. Alright. Yeah. So now, when she tuck it in, it gives, it shows the details of the pants also. Mm -hmm. The top is um, the Cyber Princess look that we were talking about, giving this kind of uh, paint effect, mm. colours. Mm. Without this thing itself, it was just going to look like a paint top. Yeah. But because of the metallic endings, mm. it, it gives it a bit of an edge. Actually, I'm not feeling the jacket. Take it out. Yeah, yeah it's nice like there. Cyber Princess, check. Military details, check. Pajama pants, check. This is indeed a noteworthy fall winter runway inspired look at a mere fraction of the price. Stay tuned for part 2 where we go on the hunt for more feminine runway looks incorporating other fall winter trends, namely royal purple, drapes, lace and sheer fabrics. <laughs>